points out. So this is consider the reaction described by the following equation. So we have this is C two H four B R in the aqueous solution plus I have three I minus. It's going to yield. Uh, let me write this down. C two H four gas plus two B R minus plus I. 3 triiodide negative, and this is all in the aqueous state here. Okay, so the rate law is the rate law here is the rate or R would equal uh, K times CH or C2, sorry, C2H4 times BR C2H4BR. times I minus where K is K K equals 4.05 times 10 to the negative 3 moles per second or molarity per second it says what are the missing entries in the following table so I believe this should have been a table here so let me just try to figure out what type of table they have here so they have runs uh, one, two, three. So I want to say that this here, um, C two H four B R two would be, uh, so this here is X 0 0.171 and 0 0.171. I want to say this is here, this table like that. I minus here is uh, 0 0.171, Y and 0 0.171. And then initial rate of formation. So this is the rate here. Rate here of this is C2. Rate is equal to C2H4. A oh, rate of C2H4, sorry. The formatting is just so poor here. C2H4 is equal to 0 0.000474. Um, oh, this would be, I guess, under this column here. 23474, 0 0.000237, and Z here. So it's asking so what's X, Y, and Z. Okay. So, um, the formatting again, very, very poor for this question, and I have to actually redraw the table, um, but it's totally fine here. So I'm giving the rate law, this is the rate law here, K times uh, the concentration of C2H4Br and, and uh, I minus here. So, and I'm giving the K value here as well. So all I have to do is basically just plug in uh, uh, plug in, plug in these values here, right? And I would, I can figure out basically, um, basically what, uh, what these values are, because I'm given the k, I'm given the k value here. So basically, all I have to do is I have to rewrite the rewrite rewrite the rate law here, and the, that's what they this student here they did that right. K equals C two H two Br uh, Br two times the concentration of I minus here, and when the rate here is zero point zero four seven four, I can simply just sub uh, sub these two guys in and calculate the uh, the 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 uh, the x value here. So let me do let me do a sample one for you. Let me show you what I mean here. So it says here the rate here equals again uh, C two H four Br two times I minus right. So this here depends on the rate here, and this is oh I'm missing the K here. Rate here in this column here. This is trial one. Uh, trial uh, actually let me write this on the bottom because you can't see this. This here I guess is run one, two, and three right. So for one run one, what I can do is I can count, I can plug in the rate here. So 0 0.000474 equals my K value, which is kind of determined um, here, right? 4.05 times 10 to the negative three. I can multiply that by X here. Again, I don't know the uh, concentration of C2H4Br2, but I do I do know the uh, concentration of zero of iodide, right? 0 0.17 one here and I can basically isolate this uh, to get X here right? I'm just dividing uh, I'm just going to move these guys and divide everything by 4.05 times 10 to negative 3 and 0 0.171 so basically uh, let me do that for you 
So I'm going to get, I'm going to move this guy over here. So I have zero point, so I'm going to divide both sides by 4.05 times 10 to the negative three, which would give me a value of, let me take out my calculator here, 0 0.000474 divided by 4.05 times 10 to the negative three. So give me a value of, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to round here. So this is 0 0.017037 uh, equals x times 0 0.171. I can simply divide this number by 0 0.171 to get me my x value, which is 0 0.68 here, which is correct. 684. And this here is correct from this run here. And basically, we're going to do the exact same thing and we use the exact same rate law to solve for y and z here. But in this case, we're isolating for y. In this case, we're isolating for our rate here. So basically, that's kind of the entire question. We just have to use this to rate law. Let me highlight this in red here. Basically, using this rate law and we're plugging in uh, the things we know and we're basically algebraically isolating for the things we don't know here. So let me just check their work to see if they algebraically did it right. Uh, so 0 0.0237 would be this right here. That's good. Um, times 0 0.71 times y. They would isolate it and they would get three, 0 0.342. That's great. And finally, rate is now z here. So I don't know the rate here, but I do know the concentrations of both uh, C2H4Br2 and I7, I minus, and I minus. I can simply just multiply through and I would get this right here. So this solution here is correct rate solution and analysis here. Uh, so I'm, I, I'm pretty sure that they got this uh, table as well and they want to kind of uh, show that in the question but it just didn't format correctly. But that's totally fine. That's number six here, great solution.